Hi guys, it's me Grim Crown. Today is a video that I wasn't expecting to make because it because it's the day before Thanksgiving. I wasn't going to post any content, but after playing this absolutely wonderful game, I knew I had to make a review on it. So you might be thinking, Grim Crown, what is this game you're talking about? Well, the game I'm talking about is a little game I found on Itch.io called Cornage. Yep, you heard me right. I said Cornage. This game is made by the Power Player and their and their brother Oblivion. The game is a farming simulator mixed with a shooter. That by itself is a cool idea, but it gets even better when you hear about how you play. You're a farmer who plants and harvests corn to make a living. But at night, evil slimes arrive and invade your farm. Now you have to use the very corn you grow to fight off the slimes. Although you can't use your weapon when you only have 25 corn left. Because of that, it makes the game more about balancing how much corn you plant versus how much you use as ammo. The game is based, uh, is time based giving you 20 seconds during the day to do things, and then when it's night, it lasts for a minute, keeping you in the action for longer. Conflict can easily be avoided though, because most enemies are slower than you, so you can get away from them quite quickly. Speaking of enemies, there are three types of enemies in this game that I will be calling the normal slime, the tiny annoying slime, and the giant oobleck. The normal slime is nothing special, and is the most common of the three types of slimes. All it does is moves toward you in a slow way. The tiny annoying slime is as its name suggests, slightly annoying. It is smaller than the normal slime and moves as fast, if not faster than the player. To balance this out, they have very low amount of health. Lastly, the giant oobleck is the scariest of them all when you have just gotten the game and don't know much about the controls. The GIANT OOBLEK looks as if it were a boss battle. This is practically the case if you think that size and health makes a boss. This slime may look intimidating, but if you're, if you're across the screen from it, it poses no threat. The GIANT OOBLEK moves very, very slow and is really easy to hit. It, it can become quite a challenge at later nights when there are more enemies that are swarming you, but by itself it is quite tame. I really like the game's soundtrack. If you couldn't tell, it's the music that's been playing in the background of the whole video. So yeah, like I said, it has a good soundtrack. I really love this game. I'll leave a link for the game in the description so you guys can play it. It's free, so you don't have to worry about paying. There are also, there's also a browser version of the game for those of you who want to play that. But overall, I rate this game a 9.5 or 10 out of 10. Great job, the power player and Oblivion. Well, that was it for me. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!